they are they are meant as like a goalie in front of the goal posts to keep any sort of viruses from getting in. So are vaccines like a 100% way to just not get sick, like not get these disease, diseases at all? You know, if there was something that was 100% effective 100% of the time, I think it would be great for us to take a vested interest in that. 100%, yeah. Love it. Hey. Vaccines are much like other uh, protection and safety devices that we have out there. So I want to use an example of driving and cars. So we get our driver's license, we're trained, we follow the rules of the road, we stay in our lanes for most the most the time, part. Yeah. yeah, you never know. But then there's inevitably potentially an accident that happens. You hopefully are wearing your seatbelt right. as your best defense against a severe illness, or excuse me, a severe injury, or even worse, potentially death. So that seatbelt helps protect you in the case that an accident occurs. That vaccine is a similar type of scenario. So that vac vaccine prevents you from having severe illness and hopefully prevents you from having death. And so we know that in that case, yes, you might have, uh, perhaps you come down with one of those vaccine preventable diseases will be a much more mild case and likely would not lead to severe illness requiring hospitalization or death. So even if I'm getting in a car wreck, and I, but I have my seatbelt on, I'm going to have like bruises and scratches, but it's going to be a heck of a lot better than probably potentially going through the front of the windshield if I didn't have the seatbelt. So same thing with the vaccines. Like if I get if I get measles, God forbid, but I'm vaccinated against it, I'm gonna. I'm, I mean, it might hurt. It's gonna be annoying, but it's not gonna be nearly as devastating if I hadn't been unvaccinated. Exactly. Okay. Great. Okay. So not a hundred percent, but a very, very, very good measure to preventing feeling all of the issues with it. So we, we've touched on this a little bit, but there's a lot of hesitancy around vaccines, especially today.